until the time has passed When I think of you, everything comes rushing back Rushing back Rushing back Like how we used to be when all you used to see was me Everything comes rushing back Hi guys, my name is Afsha Welcome to my channel This is my first time doing a YouTube video If you guys like this makeup look and want to know how I did it then please continue watching. I hope you guys like my videos. If you do please give me some love and support by subscribing to my channel and giving it a thumbs up. Thank you. For the eyeshadow base I am using the LA Girl Pro Conceal all over the eye and nicely buffing it out evenly. Eyeshadow base helps the eyeshadow stay longer without creasing. To set the base, I'm using the shade Soft Peach by Anastasia Beverly Hills Shadow Couture Palette. For the transition shade, I'm taking the color Morocco and putting it in my crease. Swiping it in and making circular motions on the outer corner I'm also creating a V shape on the outer corner and blending that out I'm taking a little product at a time and then building it up to make sure that my eyeshadow blends well From the same palette, I am taking the color fudge and putting it on the outer V. It is a slightly deeper shade of brown and blend it in the crease as well. For easy blending, take a little product at a time and blend it out. With the NYX setting spray, I will be wetting my brush to foil the eyeshadow that I will be using on my lids. You can also use water or you can use the contact solution or eye drops. Those are some safe things other than the setting spray. To apply that, I am using the press and slide technique. Taking the same brush again without taking any extra product, I am just making sure that everything is well blended. To highlight the arch of my brow, I am using the shade Soft Peach. For the lower lash line, I'm using the same color Morocco that I used on the crease. Next, on a flat brush, I am taking the color fudge and putting it super close to my lash line. For the gel liner, I'm taking the Ingrod Gel Liner AMC in 77 and I am starting from the outer corner of my eye towards the center and then the inner corner. 
making tiny strokes at first and then thickening the band. Make sure you're closest to the lash line and do not leave any space between the lash line and the liner. For the lower lash, I want a nice thick liner, so I am putting the liner, same AMC 77, in the waterline as well as a little uh, below the lash line and filling the gaps between the lashes. Once that's done, I am connecting that to the tiny wing that I created and extending it a bit. I'm just cleaning out any imperfections that may be. This also helps make the wing sharper. Always apply the mascara on the lower lash first and then the upper lash. That way, when you open your eye, you don't transfer it on your shadow. For the lipstick, I'm using Taupe by MAC Cosmetics. It's a nice uh, nudish shade. Over the MAC lipstick, I am using a liquid lipstick by Huda Beauty in the shade Bombshell. To add a little shine to that lipstick, I am using the Makiaji Glowing Shimmer Bronzer in the shade Sunkissed. So here's the final look. If you like my video, please subscribe and like my video. Thank you for watching. Baby, we can turn back time.